does anyone else look as bad as me at the end of the day? Anyway, update. Um, today, I am waiting for my blood work to come back from the doctor before I can go back down the mountain in case they need other blood for me to stop by on my way down the mountain. But today I was supposed to get the final delivery of what I'm putting in my bedroom as I try to make it mine for when I'm up here. And the mirror that I was lacking did not get delivered, although it said delivered. I contacted Timu Customer Support, put in a ticket. Um, in 24 to 48 hours, I should get my refund. They are trying to track down and see what happened. Because everything is delivered to my home, it's very odd that they would deliver it to someone else. There's only... To, some, to someone else, there's only two houses on this road, and I get all the Timu. <laughs> so, they're trying to figure this out, but they are going to make it right. And I've thoroughly enjoyed the rest of the furniture, so I can't say anything bad. But let's see if the refund goes through. I am impressed at the quality of the furniture. And um, you do need to follow the instructions to put it together, but it's terribly easy to put together if you do that. And I'm quite pleased with what it looks like and how it functions. So give them a chance. They're trying. <laughs> and as far as everything else today, I did a very good video this morning that you all need to watch. Spark some conversation. Talk about things. Get some, get some communication going about this issue. I was supposed to head back down the hill today. My nurse wants me to stay in case I have to give a secondary blood vial because there were eight tests that they were doing and she said it was odd that it did not come back today. So I should be back under the mountain by tomorrow night and hopefully I don't have to give blood again. But I'll be busy for a day or two so don't worry about me. I'm just giving repeat blood most likely and getting carted down the mountain. And when I get there, huge, huge, giant Timu haul. Like well over 35 to 50 items that have come in. Crafting, clothing, and jewelry. Um, some odds and ends. I think it'll be very fun. And we'll have a big old Timu haul when I get situated. I'm running out of clothes. I really need to be back <laughs> at mom and dad's. Um, but I'm doing okay. The new heart medicine, the new thyroid medicine is seems to be helping me a lot. I look better. I feel better today. I've not had any huge heart issues today. I'm still a little slow, but I'm feeling much better. So maybe that's why I felt like having an in-depth conversation today. I'm going to be pulling some more information if I feel like it. We're going to be discussing. And until then, everyone go watch Dr. John Campbell's video. Research. Go read the peer-reviewed journal that he leaves the link to. Maybe we'll talk about that in the next couple of days. But yeah, first package that has not been delivered in probably eight or nine months. I've only ever lost like two or three packages and they've always made it right. So this is weird, but they always make it right, so I'm not worried. And it was just a mirror. And so I can always buy one local if I need to. But um, I have my room in a big hubbub. I have all my clothes I'm sorting through, taking out the bigger ones donating them, giving them to friends, and I wish I could get my room settled, but it seems like the more I work on it, the bigger the mess is, but we'll get there, and when I do get there, I will give you all a tour, well, of you, there's not a tour, it's not big enough, but I'll let you all see what I've done, and hopefully the next time I come up here, which will probably, will probably be end of October before I really get any time, um, I'm hoping to paint while it's cool, so that will be the big change, the big the big metamorphosis of the room. So I've got stuff moving forward. I'm feeling a little bit better, so things are moving forward. I'm hoping that my blood work is not like MIA or something was wrong and they need me to refill it. That's like four and a half, five vials of blood. I don't enjoy that. But we'll find out tomorrow. My nurse is keeping a contact. And I just have to stay up here because if I go down the hill, then I have to come directly back up to give blood when I'm just four minutes from the clinic here. So it just makes sense to stay here. My nurse communicated that with me. Here I am. So Claire, if you're watching, I listen. <laughs> and um, just trying to get through the next couple of uh, days so I can get back down the mountain, get situated, and do a giant Timu haul. 
So I just wanted to check in. Thank you all so much for the kind words and the messages. I am doing better. I'm looking better. But we've still got a long way to go. But I'm optimistic. So I'm getting ready to go to bed. <laughs> it's been a long day. Hopefully the delivery man will show up and say oopsie tomorrow and actually be able to tell Timo where my mirror went. Um, but it happens, and it happens very rarely, so I'm okay with it. But I was really looking forward to that mirror. It was pretty. <laughs> oh, well. We'll just buy another one. Anyway, lots of stuff happening this week as soon as I get situated. Toss me up some good energy for my blood work, and um, let's pray that this medicine is working. I do feel a change, so let's just hope it's working. Yeah. We'll have some fun when I get back down there and see all my Timu that's come in. I'll see you in a couple of days, guys. Bye.